Jockeys, man of the match performance, how important was it to get a winning uh, return to the Shea after last week? Yeah, massive, you know, we've been talking about it all week, about sort of making up for last week and putting in a sort of older performance and I think we delivered that today, especially in the second half. Um, tough conditions, but I think we played them really well, especially in the second half and um, got, got the job done. Was it a case of kind of growing into the game um, as the conditions? We saw sort of four seasons in that in that game today. Yeah, um, definitely. That. Yeah, so important. Especially, we, we need to be better at um, being happy at six 0 Yeah, I feel like we don't have to, especially in that weather, we don't have to chase points. They'll come late on in the game if we keep sticking to our processes and stuff. So, I think that showed in today's game. We were patient, especially in, like I said in the second half, and the points came late on. Second half, we saw. Um, the relationship between you and Corey Aston found the best one through. How, how important is that working uh, in, the, in the season? Yeah, massive. You know, it's, like I said, we're a team with eleven new faces, so to to expect it all to gel and be perfect straight away is probably a bit naive of us. But you know, I'm really happy with where we're at in terms of that. I think we're not even making any excuses about there being new players. We're we're sort of taking it head on and trying to make it as good as we can. On to next week, win this. What what, what are you hoping for apart from better weather? Yeah, fingers crossed it's a bit warmer, but um, you know they're putting a big score again today. They're a team that like to move the ball, um, so we're going to have to be at our best to um, to compete, and, and hopefully we will be. And good defensive de performance to sort of set the tone, and then hopefully the points come a bit later on.